Hey everybody, it's Dr. Kara and I am here with another animal oracle card deck review. And um, this one is the Divine Dog Wisdom Cards. And these are so, so great. I had the, the pleasure of interviewing Barb Horn and Randy Crutcher, the creators of this deck for the Animal Oracle Card Summit. And that's coming up on January 25th. Um, and not only am I in love with the cards, I'm in love with them. They're amazing. You guys have to check them out. So um, they have two decks, the Divine Dog and the Cosmic Cat Wisdom Cards. I will um, share a review, a review next week of their cat cards. But here we go. Let's just open up the box and see it's a beautiful package. Um, obviously, gorgeous artwork. And just really well done on every level. It comes with a guidebook. And I really, you guys, I love this guidebook because it not only offers, you know, um, the, the image from the card, but it also offers a lot of um, discussion and things to consider around the topic of the card and another bone to chew on. So just like some questions to ask yourself, some, some points for reflection in your life. And it does that for each one. So it's a, a pretty substantial um, page and a half or so of, of text for each one of the cards. So it's gonna get those juices flowing for you when you pull a card. If it doesn't have an immediate zing for you, it's gonna give you a place to go to start to pull all those pieces together. So I um, love the guidebook. I think it's just awesome. And then let's look at the cards because the cards are beautiful. The back of the cards is so, so cute. I just love it. And I love the colors um, and they're super colorful. So just, I mean, look at these. Oh, and they're just boredom and belonging. I'm, I'm just, Boundaries. I mean, they're just great, great topics. Breakthrough and celebration. So they're they're beautiful. They're gorgeous. They're sweet. They have a little bit of everything in them, and they have some cards. And this is something that they're actually quite proud of. Um, some cards that aren't just all lightness and fluff, right? Like there's. There's some really deep stuff in here. And, um, and I think that comes directly from the depth of the wisdom of the creators, Barb and Randy. So they're just, I'm just gonna show you a few more and then we're gonna shuffle them. Um, this one is acceptance, loving what is. You know, we can have so much resistance. This is one of my favorites, balance. All the different breeds of dogs are in here and, um, you know, just some really sweet, um, plus the, the joker. Oh, it's a dog, but is it um, loneliness, right? So those cards that, um, you know, maybe a little bit deeper, a little bit harder to deal with, more challenge, loss. It happens to all of us. So um, this is a, a great card, passion, playfulness. So I just really love these cards. I love the creators, self-worth, good reminder, solitude. Sometimes that's what we need, tenderness. So, um, so those are, that's what you get when you purchase your deck. And um, they're nice, big, substantial cards that you can use in so many ways. These are great cards to get insight into yourself, insight into a situation, insight into maybe even a dog. Maybe you pull a card for what's going on with my dog or my cat or my rabbit or my horse or whatever. I'm hoping that Barb and Randy do um, a rabbit deck and a horse deck. I don't know if those are within their areas of expertise, but they've really put together some really beautiful, deep, meaningful decks that, um, that they have all the magic of any card deck um, that you can use and you can just tap into some, some really deep wisdom and some playful wisdom and, and some gentle reminders and some light reminders and, you know, just whatever the situation calls for, these cards are going to have that available. So I want to pull a card now. Um, 
Ooh, leading. I love that. The Huskies on the dog sled. Um, so I want to pull a card and this will be my forecast for the week of, I got to look at my notes, January 10th to the 16th. So ugh, um, there's 62 cards in this deck. So for my little hands, it, it does get a tiny bit unwieldy, but I love their thoroughness. This is the card I'm going to pick. I saw this one. Um, so January 10th through the 16th, the card is belonging. Find your own pack. And um, this, this really reflects the, the January forecast that I did with my Animal Wisdom Oracle cards, um, which I'll put a link in the description below as well. But, um, but this week, this is really a good time to recognize who you are, what you're part of. And, um, and, and find your people, find your tribe, find your pack. And, and you know, it, it really makes me think of that song from Shrek the Musical, Let Your Freak Flag Fly. So I really feel like this is about recognizing who you are. Stop trying to be somebody else. Recognize who you are, and that's going to show you where you fit in, who your pack is. It may not be the pack that you're in, and it may not be the pack that you think you should be in, but when you really embrace who you are, then you will naturally attract the right pack for you. And this can be one of our biggest challenges in life to just be ourselves and accept ourselves. But um, what a great feeling when we do that and then we find out we're not alone, that there are other people like us as well. So as you go through this week of January 10th, through the 16th, keep this card with you, belonging, find your pack, um, find yourself. You know, I think that's really, for whatever reason, that's what this card is saying to me for this week. So um, love yourself, accept yourself, be yourself, and you will attract your pack and find the place that you truly belong because that's just who you are. And um, I hope that helps you. I hope that sets you up for a really great week. And if you would like to meet Randy and Barb, the creators of this deck, I had the honor and pleasure of interviewing them for the 2021 Animal Oracle Card Summit. And you can join us. It's free. There are um, 10 esteemed experts from all over the world sharing their insights into how they create um, Animal Wisdom Oracle Card decks or Animal Oracle Card decks and how they use them in their lives and how they're um, helping people and helping situations and helping animals. And um, I just, it's just a wonderful, wonderful group of experts with a lot of love and generosity and positive direction for all of us to become our best selves. So I hope you'll join us. That's January 25th and 26th in 2021 and the link is below join us it's a free conference and um, everybody's invited everybody is welcome and you will get to meet randy and barb the creators of the divine dog wisdom card deck so i hope to see you there but for now have a great week and i will see you next time bye everybody